Many Muslims consider Ahmadidad to be the best Muslim apologist and debater of his time. Ahmadidad used to debate Christians in the 80s. Ahmadidad challenged the holy living God of the Bible, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. We are talking about 35 years ago. Many of you know the devastating end of Ahmadidad. In the 80s, Dida debated a Christian apologist by the name of Josh McDowell. We actually believe that God set up Ahmadidad in that debate to embarrass him in front of many people. Among the crowd were hundreds of Muslims and Christians. In that debate, Ahmadidad made an embarrassing challenge that actually ended his career. There is not a single statement made by Jesus Christ that I was dead and I have come back from the dead. Jesus Christ never uttered that word that I have come back from the dead. I, I'm not sure that I heard myself that you said nowhere in the 27 books of the New Testament did Jesus ever say he was dead, dead and alive? May I read to you from the book of Revelation, chapter 1, verse 18? He said, I am the living one. I was dead, and behold, I am alive forevermore. Ahmadidad, as you heard, was defeated in this debate. Josh McDowell completely annihilated him by quoting the book of Revelation, chapter 1, verse 18. And you heard Josh McDowell quoted Ahmadidad and asked him, Did you just say that nowhere in the 27 books of the New Testament where Jesus said, I was dead and I came to life? And you heard the response of the crowd when Josh McDowell quoted the book of Revelation 1, 18. I am the living one, I was dead, and behold, I am alive forevermore. Glory to Jesus, the name above all names. He is risen, and risen is he indeed. Hallelujah. Muslims, this is the end of your amazing hero, Ahmed Didad. As you see, when you're going to deceive hundreds, thousands, and millions of Muslims, in the end, you're going to get spanked and served for everybody to see. Thank you for watching. Download this video and spread it all over social media. Thank you for watching and God bless.